Hi there, Ennio from Ambience here. Today I'm inviting you to my new house. So, me and my fiancé uh, just uh, bought a new house in our little town in the middle of Italy, not too far from Rome. And I made a little project in Unity to understand how to furnish the living room. Now I want to make a step further and uh, I want to use augmented reality uh, to see how my decor idea actually works in the real world. So let's do it! So this is the project in Unity. I used Pro Builder uh, to make my 3D model because I was curious uh, to understand how this plugin works. And well, it's okay, but uh, not so much for this kind of project. It uh, definitely needs uh, to be improved with classic uh, CAD commands. As you can see, uh, if I want to create a very precise mesh, I can do it only in the new shape uh, panel. Then if I want to extrude by a certain amount, I need to type the, um, the, this amount, for example 2.7 meters directly, while the command uh, is still working. But hey, it does the job, uh, it creates meshes that are uh, super ready for light mapping, so we can use it. Now, uh, let's add the uh, augmented reality functionality. Uh, we are going to use uh, AT Explorer 1.3, uh, where this AR build template has been integrated. So, all I need to do is to switch template, uh, click apply, uh, wait for the plugin to do its magic. Now we need to add uh, Tom in the scene, but only as a starting point. The camera will be positioned by AR Core or AR Kit. And uh, the next step is to add a uh, marker. The marker is uh, like a connection point between the virtual space, this virtual space, and the real one. I can uh, uh, click this button here and put it on the floor next to a wall edge. So, uh, if I add the marker here, I need to put it in the same exact spot uh, in the real world. How can we do it? Well, we need to print it. We included a PDF file with 10 markers. Uh, we choose only one and print it. Last step is to say to Unity to use ER plugin providers uh, for this project at Startup. And we can do this by going to Edit, Project Settings, XR uh, Plugin Management and uh, enabling uh, this and this. Now we can build the project and test it uh, in the office, in our office. After that, we are going to my house and uh, see it uh, in action. Right now, I'm going to use my old uh, Samsung Galaxy S7 phone, but after that I'm going to transfer uh, the Unity project in macOS and build, and build it uh, for the iPad Pro. 
Okay, uh, so the project is aligning well to the marker, but before we proceed, I'm going to add some interaction. We have some doubt uh, with the color of this wall over here, and I want to prepare more options. So we can change uh, all options uh, in uh, augmented reality. If you are familiar with IT Explorer, you know how this interaction is easy to add. And uh, in AR, the process is the same. Just click on the wall, add a new switch material interaction, uh, put the color switcher on the wall, and uh, add all the possible colors uh, you want. Okay, now we are ready. I'm going to put this uh, project on my MacBook and hopefully in half an hour we are going to have the project up and running on the iPad. Oh, um, I'm using Git uh, to transfer the project. I know for sure that this isn't a technology well known to architects and engineers engineers, but it is so helpful to avoid something like uh, this. Uh, um, so thousands of copies of the same file, uh, a mess with USB keys to share the project. Uh, we are preparing a video on this, so be sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. Uh, we have the project on the MacBook. While building for Android is very easy and you can do it directly from the Unity editor uh, once everything is set up. Here uh, you need to export the project in Xcode, then build uh, using Xcode. So let's do this. Let's switch platform. then build choosing a folder and then open uh, uh, the output project in Xcode to build on uh, our iPad. and build. Okay, we have the project on uh, our iPad Pro and now we can go inside my house.
Do you like the project? You can get this update of AT Explore for free if you have already bought uh, a license. I leave you the link in the description below. What do you think about uh, this application of augmented reality? Are you already using it? Please let us know in the comments below. Bye!